सो हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल आई होप यू गाइज आर डूइंग वेल सो इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट दी ब्लेंडर डी ओ वी फीचर इट्स कॉल्ड डेप्थ ऑफ फील्ड एंड इट्स बेसिकली यूज टू क्रिएट अ डेप्थ बिटवीन दी ऑब्जेक्ट एंड दैट इज वेरी कूल फीचर ओके एंड माई प्रीवियस वीडियो आई टॉक अबाउट दी कैमरा सेटिंग ओके हाउ यू कैन सेट योर कैमरा हाउ यू कैन टेक योर फर्स्ट रेंडर एक्सेट्रा एक्सेट्रा ओके एंड इफ यू गाइज डिडेंट सी दैट वीडियो यट प्लीज गो एंड चेक इट आउट बिकॉज इन दैट वीडियो आई एल टोड अबाउट दी सेटिंग्स ओके हाउ ऑल दी कैमरा सेटिंग्स हाउ टू यूज द कैमरा एंड हाउ यू कैन टेक योर फर्स्ट रेंडर आई टॉक अबाउट ऑल कैमरा सेटिंग्स सो इफ यू गाइज नॉट सी दैट वीडियो यट आई टॉक अबाउट ऑल दी सेटिंग लाइक अ लेंस कैमरा सेटिंग सेफ एरियाज ओके एंड everything okay i talk about the all three orthographic panoramic uh, cameras as well so if you guys not see that video please go check it out that video first then you will understand that video very well so yeah so without any further delay now let's get started so right now here you can see guys uh, i have taken one render okay and here you can see i i use the depth of field basically here here you can see um our focus object is, is the first one and that it's a little bit blur then it's more then more and more and more so this is basically use a uh, uh, distance it is showing the distance between the object okay so the last object is more blur because it's uh, so far from the front object so that's why it's looking so blurred okay and how you can create that effect basically and make sure guys don't use the more blur okay because it's not looking good okay you can play with that blur but it's 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 a good thing to play but uh, make sure you don't use okay because uh, the the object should be visible okay if you if you increase the blurness it's a higher okay so that that object will not visible so we don't do that because we have to uh, show that last object as well but it should it's it's not should be focused okay but if people can imagine okay that which object is uh, the behind okay so make sure don't uh, increase the more value of the depth of field okay means the blur and uh, yeah so now i'm going to talk about uh, the that feature so here you can see guys here i have some little setup and uh, you can download that project file uh, free i will put the link into the description you can download from there and use it and you can tag me on instagram and share your uh, project with me okay guys yeah guys so here you can see uh, we have a s uh, 7 8 pumpkins okay so right now if i will go to the camera view and i'm go to the depth of field uh, option so here you can see i set the focus object that so right now i'm just going to delete everything and uh, start from this case so here you can see uh, this is our camera view and uh, i select my camera and here i got the camera settings and i'm just going to off all the settings because we need only depth of field so so when i will enable it here you can see so here you can see uh, we got some blur on our object okay and make sure you enable that limit option basically and uh, what is does exactly here you can see if i go to the top view and if i will enable that limit view so it's showing basically limit okay and we can increase the size as well of that limit it's it's showing the limit okay when that which area that blur will affect it okay so make sure you you enable that uh, features then after that you can come back the depth of field section and here is the basic distance so distance basically uh, create uh, here you can see when i'm increasing the distance it's showing the distance okay it's if i will show in the top view here you can see that uh, limit part is increasing okay so this is basically distance between the each and every object so it's showing the distance so if so here you can see right now i am just play with the distance and here you can see what happening so when that uh, that distance bar is going things is blurred okay so right now i said zero so distance in in the front of the camera okay all front of the object that's why it all 
all uh, object is sh showing blur so first of all you have to set the distance okay so for example i need uh, that object on focus second one so i can set the here okay and now i will increase the f force basically it's a picture of showing the yeah here you can see when i in decreases it's uh, showing all blur so when i'm increasing here you can see it's, it's showing the uh, clear everything okay so basically this is showing the distance also okay this is the blurriness so yeah if i will increase it the lens is taking only that focus object after that it's not taking anyone okay and this is the blood and i think uh, you should uh, keep that blood in default 3 okay it's work good and this is the rotation if you want to rotate rotate your blur so here you can see you can rotate very easily but i think it's not using i'm not using basically sometimes it's useful and this is the ratio by the way if you increase it here you can see it's showing the uh, ratio of blurness so you can decrease and increase from here okay okay so you don't uh, it's it's a depend on your uh, model it's your depend on your project okay which which thing you want to focus on not okay then now i'm just going to uh, show you so for example i need that uh, that second pumpkin on the focus area so i set like that and i increase the little bit f, f stop so now i'm just going to take a so now I'm just going to take a render. So here you can see. So yeah, here you can see all the object are blurred, but only second uh, second uh, pumpkin is showing uh, clear. So because I said the uh, my limit is on the second option, so that's why it's showing. Okay, and main thing is that if you set the uh, limit on a particular object so it will show a little bit uh, clear on the their nearest uh, object also so here you can see we can much more easily see that front one but uh, we can't see the last one very well okay so it, it's 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 showing it's not affected more the front object and the means the nearest nearest object is not affected more but that that when that uh, uh, limit is increasing that distance is increasing these object will in make a more blur and we can't unable to find it okay imagine ki which object is that uh, we talk about that uh, f stop we all talk about these options now I'm just going to talk about the what is that basically focus object so right now here you can see we have a limit and we can set our limit basically and then we can uh, increase our distance and then we got the uh, our object okay in a focus and defocus but if here is a focus object option also so you can assign your focus object like that I'm just going to assign that object so everything going to blur that except that focus object okay so now you can decrease your uh, little bit uh, f stop because we need to show everything so now it's looking cool okay and for example i'm just going to increase the blurness file for example and i'm cutting the that object and I'm, I'm i need that that object on focus so here you can see that object is focused and everything is going blurred okay and i told now whatever things is near by that object it will little bit show except that other things here you can see i need that object on blur on on focus so here you can see all object is getting blurred and one more thing you can do with that what you can do you can add one empty okay sometimes it's it's good to in animation and I will also talk about in animation part okay when I make the animation video okay so it's good to for animation so for example I add one empty like that okay and I'm stuck going to my camera setting and select that empty yeah so now when I will move the empty here you can see that focus is uh, decreasing and increasing because it it, it works same like uh, that that distance one okay so but sometimes it's good 
we can uh, use in animation part that things here you can see when I'm, I'm moving that empty so that focus is uh, changed to each and every object here you can see okay guys yeah so I'm going to delete that and uh, I'm selecting my camera and I'm setting that focus object and I told you in the beginning you don't uh, use the more blur so just keep minimal so we can imagine the things and that is good okay guys and uh, if you don't watch my first video of camera settings okay first part of that video so make sure you watch that video then after that you can better understand what I'm talking about in this video okay so in that video I talk about the basics of camera yeah guys and you can also download that project file I will put the link into the description you can download from there free and uh, try it out and uh, tag on me Instagram and I will see you or you on Instagram and I will see you also in the next video and thanks for watching this video guys if you learn something in this video please hit the like button hit the share button and subscribe my channel also and if you have any queries if you have any suggestion please let me know in the comment box I will definitely reply your comment so bye bye take care stay home